In the video for today, I'm going to show you how to track a lost Android phone using a specific application. The best part is this is totally free of cost to do so. You don't have to pay any money like a subscription fee or a sign up fee and only then get the location of your phone. Nothing of that sort. Watch my video till the end so that you understand how to do this properly. get hold of you so the first thing is I want you to get hold of your Android smartphone and get on to Google Play once you do that the next thing is you tap on the search box out here and just type in Google find my device once you do that select the first option and you are going to see an option to download an application from Google known as Find My Device. So you install this on your phone and then you open it. Once you open it, you need to log in with the same email address that you had on your device that you have misplaced. Once the application opens up, you could select sign in as guest. Once you do that, you get directed to this page in which you could sign in in the guest mode to find my device. So you could put in the same email address that was on the lost or stolen phone or the misplaced phone. Click on next, put in the password and click on next again. Once you do that, you get logged into Google find my device on your phone itself okay so since i'm trying to locate my own phone on my device it's going to show me my phone location out here but uh, if you have misplaced your phone like i mentioned to you earlier and you're trying to use your friend's phone or uh, you know anybody else's phone you could actually see the location of your phone and you could get it back so here if you have multiple devices attached to this email address you could select that specific device which is misplaced and then you get the location of that phone itself you may just have one or two or three attached to the same email address you could select your phone accordingly and find it and you could play sound even if it is in silent mode or you could even secure your device if you select this option it's going to lock your device no matter where it is or whoever has it and you could also erase your device so whatever data is synced to your google account from your phone to the same email address is going to get erased now two very important things you need to understand about google find my device the first thing is your phone has to be connected to the internet i mean the lost phone if it is not connected to the internet this is not going to work but most probably if you have misplaced your phone and it is genuinely not visible anymore on maps because you know the battery died or it you know went underwater and it died or whatever it is any genuine reasons then it's okay but still i would suggest you file in an fir or put in a report to the local police station so that you are not you know pulled up by chance if it is recovered and somebody else tries to misuse it and, and the second thing is if somebody finds a phone and has no intention of giving it back to you i'm very much sure they are going to connect the phone to the internet within the next 24 to 48 hours or whatever so i would suggest you keep a constant eye on google find my device so that you get an idea about where your phone was last because to erase the phone they actually have to switch on your phone and uh, connect to the internet so that time frame within which they switch on your phone and erase your phone is enough to track through google find my device so i hope you found this useful and you got some value out of my video for today if you did give it a thumbs up post a comment subscribe and hit the bell notification icon take care my friend